Good afternoon, YouTube. Papa on Josie's homestead with you. Josie back over here. See right there. There's Josie. But, uh, we ain't fooling with the rabbits today. And uh, just going to give you what I've kind of learned and figured out and mistakes I've made with breeding these rabbits. Uh, hope you guys can get something out of it. If uh, nothing else, just learn from the mistakes I've made and breeding your rabbits. So about 40 days ago now, I bred Keith here, it's a New Zealand white, with Rose. There's, oh. out here, there Rose. Get in here and see her. But uh, I only had one fall off with those two. And so I wouldn't positively for sure that she was pregnant. And it wound up that she was. But I keep track. I got a calendar up here in my barn. I keep track of everything. Uh, when I got my pigs, uh, this, uh, let's see, what's that say? Put Betty in with Jeffrey here, uh, breeding Rose, Betty, but, Keep everything marked down on the calendar. My mistake I made with Rose on that one was I watched a video and either I misunderstood it, I'll just say I misunderstood it. But uh, I counted my days wrong. So whenever she was what I thought was due, she had passed that date up. And so I really didn't think she was pregnant because she only had the one fall off so I didn't do anything I keep hay in here so this side over here actually had hay in it this side over here is just the screen bottom uh, on day 31 she actually had her litter that day or that night when we come out that morning they were all over here on the screen side uh, and then none of them made it so that's I'm taking blame on that one uh, didn't do enough research I guess but she lost all that litter. She had one litter before and she had them over here. She only had three and one of them made it. She built her nest, she pulled her fur out, built her nest and everything before she had them. This time, she didn't pull the fur. Uh, it was on Saturday morning we come out here and all the babies was over here and they were all dead. So I disposed of them. Come back this that evening to do their feeding and she started building a nest. So uh, they don't always necessarily make their nest before they have them. I figured that one out. So that's kind of one of the things I was watching for was for her to make her nest. Then I thought she would have them, but so that was my one of my mistakes. Count my days wrong, and expecting her to make a nest before she had them. So that that was my mistakes. Uh, so this time I bred her and Keith again this morning. Got, you guys watched that video. Um, I got my days figured out this time on my calendar. Uh, I'll show you what they've done on my calendar here. But, uh, oh. 
Gotta go up to March. I actually marked them February when I bred them. But like Betty, uh, she's due here. There's five days there that she should go in that five days. Rose is down here with the new breeding. I get the five days. Now it could be longer, but shouldn't be any earlier than that. That's 28 days. And I got it marked up to 28, 29, 30, 31, 32. I got it marked up to 32. So it uh, could be a little longer than 32, but most likely it won't be before 28. But, uh, but Jeffrey and Betty here should have the next litter. And I'm gonna go ahead and let her have them in this and whenever it gets closer to time, which she's pretty much full of hay there now, because I feed them hay uh, besides their pellets that they get. But uh, I'm gonna make sure she's got a good solid bottom in there and kind of watch the weather and see if it's gonna be cold or not. If it's gonna be cold, I got heat lamps I can put up and everything like that. But uh, we'll uh, keep you guys posted on any new litters that we have. And uh, hopefully I can do better with the next ones. Because I hated that Rose lost that many. But anyway, learn from some of my mistakes. Uh, keep your calendar. Make sure your days are right. Uh, make sure your nesting area is ready and all that good stuff. As I said, I, that really, really disappointed me because I was hoping I could get them out of it. But, uh, I was going to tell you on our video you seen I had uh, with uh, Keith and Rose, I had two fall offs. Uh, Keith is a new buck. He's doing better. Uh, like I said, the last time I put him with Rose, it took almost three times before he actually got a fall off. And then he only got one. This time he got two. Uh, so, uh, they, what I understand from videos, three or more ensures that uh, you get your does pregnant. Uh, like I said, he got it in one last time, so hopefully this time he had two, so hopefully he's got her pregnant, and we'll have some baby rabbits here for it all. But appreciate you guys watching. If you would, subscribe. Like. Check us out on Facebook. All right, you going to tell him bye now? I don't think I had the camera on you. You going to wave bye? But, uh, me and Josie appreciate you watching. Uh, don't mind. Subscribe, hit the likes, comments, uh, suggestions. Anything you can get. Uh, but appreciate you watching. You guys have a good day.